eDoctrina offers access to several powerful data reports. After the assessment has been created in eDoctrina and administered to the students, teachers and administrators can log into eDoctrina and choose from many of our reports to see a breakdown of student data on any particular assessment. Our reports are housed on the teacher dashboard, which is where users can print bubble sheets, assign assessments online for students to take, scan answer sheets using a document camera, and manually enter information. The reports are broken up into two categories, standard reports first, and then advanced reports. By filtering for the students and assessment you would like to pull data for, you can then choose the data report that would best fit your needs. We have a class summary report, which is our fan favorite and easiest to read for a quick snapshot of how your students scored. By clicking the Run Report button, the report will generate with the student's name to the left, followed by their student ID number being pulled from your student management system, what they scored, and what their overall percent was on the assessment. You can also color code your assessments by creating a grade conversion table. This will allow you to decipher your data reports much easier. By scrolling through this report, you can also see your class average along with a breakdown in numbers of where your students fell on the assessment. Back to the teacher dashboard, another popular report would be our item analysis report. This will give you a detailed breakdown of each individual question, also showing the linked standards below this bar graph gives you an idea of the answers your students selected. You know what the correct answer is. And also, if your assessment was created in eDoctrina, you can click on this question box to pull open the question and refer to without ever having to leave the report. Our individual student report has several options. You can print a report based on the standards linked to the assessment. A lot of our high school teachers utilize the condensed format of the individual student report. This will print four or five students to a page and allow the teachers to paper slice under each student so the students can receive slips of information. They're able to see the score they earned on the test and what their percent was. Our assessment for learning format within the individual student report allows the students to self-assess how they did on the standards or skills linked to that particular assessment. They're able to decide whether or not these are standards or skills they know and are comfortable with, or if they made simple mistakes on the questions linked to that standard, or if those are certain skills that they need help on. Also, towards the end of each report, for every student, they have an opportunity to tell the teacher the skills they feel good at, the ones they are so-so at, and the ones they need to keep learning. The class comparison report allows teachers to pull data from multiple classes on one assessment. This is a fantastic tool for teachers who work collaboratively or for those who have team data meetings to see how the students did overall on the standards or skills being taught. Our student standards report will give you a breakdown of how each individual student scored on the standards linked to the assessment. You can reshuffle these columns if you want to see who scored the lowest on the standard by reshuffling from A to Z or who scored the highest. Our RTI progress monitoring report allows you to create a report for one student showing progress over several assessments throughout the year. This is a great report to use for parent teacher conferences. In the advanced reporting options, we have several level two reports, along with a custom export report, which allows users to create their own report with up to 10 individualized columns. You can choose to show students first and last name, the name of the test, or a breakdown of how the student scored. This of course was a very brief highlight on just a few of the data reports eDoctrina has to offer.